So now they're going towards the mulberry tree. The mulberry bush. I remember singing the song, Merry Go Round the Mulberry Bush, Mulberry Bush, Mulberry Bush. So this is the mulberry bush I was talking about yesterday. Wow, look at these. These are mulberries. Fresh red mulberries, which I just plucked from the mulberry plant from the mulberry bush in our garden. In our villa, we have a mulberry bush, a beautiful tree. And this was planted by our neighbor, a dental surgeon. He planted this around four or five years back. And now we are all enjoying the fruits of that. Look at this. So they're so juicy. The moment you keep these mulberries in your mouth, it just melts on your tongue. And it's so tasty. Have you ever tasted mulberries? If you have, please comment in the comment box below. Now I'll take you to that mulberry tree. So we'll go to that mulberry tree now. Come on, let's go. This is a beautiful villa where I stay. We have a lot of trees here, plants here. Look at this mayflower. It looks so beautiful. The red flowers, you know. So now we're going towards the mulberry tree. The mulberry bush. I remember singing the song. Merry go round the mulberry bush. Mulberry bush, mulberry bush. So this is the mulberry bush I was talking about yesterday. So this is the mulberry bush I was talking about yesterday. Look at this. This is the mulberry tree. And this particular mulberry tree or this mul mulberry fruit is called as the Himalayan mulberry. I found out there are two kinds of mulberries. One is the long one. This is the, this is, this is the one which has a long fruit. See, These are long fruits and this is called as the Himalayan mulberry. And the other type is a round one which you see in the western countries and all that. So this Himalayan mulberry is also supposed to be a very good variety of mulberry. It's very sweet. The fruit is very juicy. And uh, as I read about mulberries, I came to know that the fruit, when it is ripe, has got a lot of uh, health benefits. And uh, one more interesting fact about this uh, Himalayan mulberry is that the uh, sap of this tree is considered to be very poisonous. And even the unripe fruit, they say, it might be very toxic when you take a lot of uh, them when you consume a lot of uh, unripe fruit you may get hallucinations you no know? it might affect your brain you may get a kick kind of feel you know you may get some hallucinations and it can even cause uh, some stomach symptoms diarrhea and all that look at this this is a mulberry on the tree on the bush this is a, a ri ripe one and when it is ripe it becomes a maroon red and it looks beautiful also so you can see more of them these are the mulberry fruits. Believe me, it's very, very tasty. It's so juicy. And I've uh, read about uh, mulberries that uh, they have a lot of nutrition in them. They have very rare trace elements like manganese and all that. And a lot of nutrition. And it's also a good cure for diabetes. That, that's what I heard. And uh, diabetes, I think it may, not, it may not cure diabetes totally, but it can reduce your blood sugar. And uh, they even uh, warn you that you should not eat a lot of them because it might drop down your sugar to a great extent that you may get hypoglycemia. And uh, one more thing I uh, uh, read about this is that uh, an interesting fact is that in India especially, they use these mulberries to feed the silkworms in the silkworm industry. You know, that's what. So these are some facts about the mulberries. And uh, look at this fruit. It's uh, really, 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 really very tasty. So in if you happen to get a mulberry plant or sapling or something, please plant it in your garden. Within two or three years, it will start fruiting. It doesn't need a lot of care. It doesn't need a lot of fertilizers. It doesn't need a lot of water also. So this is the this is about the tree. And this is a this is in our garden. We have some other trees also here. We have a moringa tree. One day I'll tell you about the benefits of moringa also. This is a moringa tree with a lot of drumsticks on it. So, thank you guys. Take care. Bye.